right now there are several potential crime scenes under investigation across Denver. The now has crews at all of them bringing you live coverage. We start with Denver 7 investigator Tony Kovaleski. He is live at 37th and Federal where all this started. Tony. Teresa, here's what we know right now. One suspect in custody with gunshot wounds being treated at Denver Health. A second suspect potentially at large at this hour. Let us paint a visual picture for you right now. It all started late this morning, about four blocks west of here, the 3400 block of 38th Avenue. It started as a carjacking. Then it came. There's still a lot we're trying to figure out right now. We're not sure the chronology of how everything played out. You're looking at cell phone video moments after the shooting. Video captured by a resident showing a Denver police officer getting loaded into an ambulance. Minutes before, neighbors and eyewitnesses say they heard 10 to 12 gunshots. The officer called out a traffic stop about 1121. About 1123, he called out that he had been shot. At that point in time, officers covered into the area. They saw a vehicle leaving the area at a high rate of speed. Here's what we know right now. Investigators taking a look at the scene. That's where the routine traffic stop happened. An unmarked police vehicle. Uh, the officer involved in the shooting was in uniform at the time. You can see the investigators have been taking a look and mapping out the crime scene from the past two to three hours here. Bottom line, what we know right now, one suspect at large, another in custody being treated at Denver Health. We've also heard from a well-placed source that there was an AK-47 in the suspect's vehicle. That was was captured at the scene about five, six blocks from here as they continue to pursue it from this location. That's what we know now, reporting live in Northwest Denver. I'm Tony Kovaleski, Denver 7.